It's not just sitting there looking pretty for nothing. It should be actively promoting your newsletter for one, because as a musician, your newsletter is key. Hi, I'm Anitra J from the Crafty Musician blog. I post weekly videos right here on YouTube helping musicians build a fan base and make money with music. Today, we're going to talk about how you can use your website to convert website visitors into actual newsletter subscribers. If you want to learn more DIY hacks for your music career, subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell to be personally notified every time we upload a new video. Okay, so before we get started in this video, I want to remind everyone that the book giveaway is still in play. So if you want a free copy of The Label Machine by Nick Sadler, go ahead and sign up at the link below in the description box. As a musician, if you are trying to level up your business, start your own record label is the way to go. It's going to help you to not only have more access to promoting, but also to attract other musicians and provide record label services for other musicians and help you make more paper. Okay. So if you want to learn how to start and run your own record label, Get you a copy of this book, The Label Machine by Nick Sadler. And I have one free copy for one lucky person. So if you haven't signed up yet, go ahead and use the link below in the description box. Sign up. All you have to do is give me your name and email address. And I am going to announce the winner live on this channel, November 1st at 10 o'clock a.m. So don't be afraid to sign up and we are going to have a party. Okay, November 1st. And it's the first time we're going to actually go live on this channel so hopefully everyone comes out <laughs> y'all don't leave me here stranded alone by myself okay so uh, sign up and I will see you on November 1st all right so let's talk newsletter your newsletter is priority number one if it's not it definitely should be because it is the best way for you to directly promote your services your live entertainment your music services your merchandise to your followers you don't have to worry about as many rules or algorithms on social media you can say your piece and just feel comfortable sharing that with your direct subscribers you can also directly promote your shows and not have to worry about all these other rules and regulations now if you want to talk about politics if you want to talk about your background you want to get into the nitty-gritty of your music and everything that's the best way to do it is to have your newsletter because it is a direct channel to your followers and also they can respond to you and it's more private and intimate like for example you really can't share a lot of stuff because nowadays they're censoring people on social media. You really can't share a lot of stuff and a lot of the things you want to share with your with your followers and your fans on social media. And your newsletter is the best way to do that next to text messaging. OK, like if you want to talk about conspiracy theories. OK, listen, I am a conspiracy theory nut. I've been known to put on my tinfoil hat from time to time. It's fun. I like it. It's good to like it's it's fun to theorize and you know talk crazy or whatever you don't have to worry about being censored okay so that's one of the um advantages but it's plenty of advantages especially when it comes to selling your merchandise selling tickets promoting your shows and all of that business so if you want to build your business if you're uh if you're serious about building your business your newsletter is priority number one like i said before so doing Everything you can do on your website to promote your newsletter and convert visitors to actual newsletter subscribers is the best thing you can do for yourself and your business as a musician. So number one, let's talk about pop-up um, promotions, pop-ups, okay? Now, a pop-up is a great way to grab someone's attention. Now, I know that there's a lot of, you know, talk about how pop-ups can be 
what's it called invasive and a distraction and yes it can be you don't want to use pop-ups excessively or invasively to where it distracts your visitor from actually enjoying your website and going on your website and getting the information that they need to get so you definitely need to have some rules of thumb some guidelines as to how you present your pop-ups but statistics show that pop-ups will actually help you to increase your conversion rate so I definitely suggest to try pop-ups like one of the things you should do is not have the pop-up pop up right away let the visitor hang out on your website for a few seconds like 20 or 30 seconds before you say hey sign up to this newsletter okay so make sure that they are engaged in your website engaged in the information that they're looking for and then like just do a little slide in oh hey by the way since you're here Go ahead and sign up to my VIP list. I will give you uh, an exclusive soundtrack or an exclusive of my new release or something fun that you're going to give them in exchange for their email and their name and whatever ever whatever other information you're looking to get. So utilize pop-ups. That's a great way to increase your conversion rates. Now this is a really easy one and very easy to implement. If you have a blog on your website and you are actively posting new blog articles, make sure at the end of every blog that you have a blurb about your newsletter and ask them to subscribe to your newsletter. Give them a really good reason why they should subscribe. Like if you're giving away something for free or if you're giving away an exclusive or if you are doing some sort of really interesting series right now or whatever it is. But give them a reason to subscribe and share the link. And make sure this is on every single blog post. That is something that's really easy to implement and it's a great way to promote your newsletter in kind of a subtle way because it's at the bottom of your blog post that they come over to read from a search engine or maybe if you promoted it on your social media people are coming in reading your material and your content it's interesting and it gives them a little taste of what could possibly be in your newsletter so that's a great way to implement promoting your newsletter in a very subtle way Another very easy way to promote website visitors into newsletter subscribers on your website is to implement a squeeze page. Now, a squeeze page is a landing page that when people go into your website, this is the first thing they see. And all that's on the page is basically, hey, guys, I'm Anitra J. I have this for free. Go ahead and sign up and I will send it to you automatically and then have a way to exit that screen. That is you simply saying before you do anything on this website, hey, I want to give this to you for free. All you have to do is sign up. They can either sign up or they can exit out and go into your website. It's a great way to promote your newsletter automatically right when people come in. All right, so those are a few tips that I have for you to utilize your website to promote your newsletter and convert website visitors to newsletter subscribers. If you're looking for more tips, if you want all the tips, I've got more tips for you on my blog. Blog, I will leave a link to that blog post in the description box below. Thanks for watching and keep it crafty. Head on over to thecraftymusician.com for more tips and tricks to level up your music career. Talk to you soon.